Supercross Live here on supercrossonline.com. Kevin Barnett catching up with Monster Energy Pro Circuit Kawasaki's Dean Wilson. Dean, finally the season starts. I know it's been a long time for me, um, but I'm just so happy to be here and be racing and all that. Just, you know, I'm actually at racing, I'm racing and not watching. So I'm just happy to be here and going to do my best and just excited to be here, really. With all the stuff I that went I've on, I've said that enough times. I'm just really excited to be here. <laughs> With all the stuff that went on over the summer, it seems like you landed as well as you could. I mean, you might be a cat land on your feet. It could be, you know, and you never know. It could be a blessing in disguise, you know, because um, I wasn't really like that pumped to be riding a 250, just because it's hard for me because I'm tall and you know I'm, I'm heavier than most of them. But um, I, you know, when I decided that I wanted to do the 250. You know, I really worked hard, and I've worked really hard this whole se well off season, I guess you could, you could call it. And um, we really just got the bike set up for me. You know, it's like it's set up really good for me, and I feel comfy on it. So I think it's, it could be. A, you know, you never know. We'll see how it works out in the end. But if it works out the way I want it to work out, and that's when the championship, then it was all worth it. So yeah, I don't know. I'm just excited. As you've gotten taller and a little bit heavier, it's up to you to look for the advantages to having that type of frame. Where do you think you can really get the advantage? Just in the whoops. I'm pretty fast in the whoops. And then, uh, I don't know, just little things. But um, I did grow a little bit, but um, I'm not really that heavy, really. I'm like 165, so it's like kind of average. So it's pretty good for, for how tall I am. So I don't know, it should be good. How is the body feeling? Uh, body's feeling really good. Um, this is the most prepared I've ever came into the season, I think. You know, I've just done, I feel like I've done everything there's to be done. And now it's just time to put it to the test. What do you think about the track so far today? Uh, looking at it, it looks okay. It's, the dirt's are really hard. It's like, um, it's, I don't know. It's just there's, it's like concrete. It's weird the dirt here, but so far it looks okay. How much time do you spend looking at your competitors? I mean, coming in, there's a lot of talk about you being the favorite, but then there's a lot of guys behind you. Who do you think about as far as championship challenges? Um, I think, uh, you know, to be honest, I don't really pay attention because, you know, you just have to be worrying about yourself and have to be worrying about what I'm doing, but. You know, at the end of the day, I think there's the, the four main guys are going to be like, um, Warren's going to be good, Will Hahn's going to be good, and um, Muskin, of course. So there's going to be quite a few good guys, and um, I don't know, it should be a good racing. Okay, I can't let you go without getting a music pick out of you. A music pick? Uh, what's my song for the, the yeah. weekend? Um, I think uh, I've liked this new song, Kid Inc., and it's called Hell and Back. That's, it's a good, it's a tune, it's a tune.